everybody, this is Randy Santel. Atlas and I am very, very nervous today because this massive barbecue sandwich sitting in front of me is absolutely huge. I am going for overall win number 929. I'm for the first time in Gulfport, Florida. We have lots of people here, which is much appreciated. I am here at Smokin' Jay's Real Texas Barbecue. They've had this challenge going on for quite a while now. I've been wanting to try it. It's finally time, but there is so much meat, over five pounds, I think. There's one pound of their chicken, one pound of smoked sausage, one pound of their pulled pork, one pound of their delicious looking brisket. And then along with that, there is a rack of boneless ribs. Along with all that meat, we've got some of their red onions, we've got some of their pickles, and then normally you get a raw jalapeno, but we just have pickled jalapenos today. So that is good for me. Along with that, we've got 14 ounces of freshly baked bread. And then I had to go with two sides. And they had a couple options. I went with healthy green beans and then coleslaw. It's like nine pounds total. I've got an hour, so we'll just do our best. But if I fail this challenge, it's gonna be around $50. But if I win, I'll get my meal free. I will get a sweet t-shirt. I'll be the fourth person with my name and photo up on the wall of fame. I'll get a custom mug mailed to me, so that's exciting. And I will get a $100 gift certificate to use later. So let's get this challenge started. All right, I'm coming off that delicious, massive nine pound burrito challenge win yesterday in Sarasota. This is another big one. Haven't lost in 2021. Gonna keep the winning streak going, hopefully, but we'll just do our best. If I fail, but still do my best, I'll be all right. Big thank you to John and his team here at Smokin' Jay's Real Texas Barbecue for having me in to do the challenge. My friends, Nathan, Joel, and Dan Kennedy, they've all beaten this challenge. Nathan did it a couple years ago on a second attempt. He finished in just under the one hour time limit. Joel and Dan, they finished in just under 17 minutes, not too long ago. That's crazy. Thankfully, I've got an hour. Let's shut up and eat. One, two, three, boom. All right, the key to winning this is gonna be hardly any water. I'm just gonna start off with their brisket and let's go. Five minutes, 10 seconds in, we're almost done with the brisket. I'm trying to go as long as possible without drinking any water. I need all the space I can get. Last bite of the brisket. This rack of ribs is freaking huge, so I'm just gonna try to get these down next. Hopefully these are tender. Oh yeah. A lot of ribs here. I'd almost say two pounds maybe, I don't know. minutes 57 seconds we still got 45 minutes to go Thirty-nine minutes to go. Twenty-one minutes in. Two more bites of rest. One 
Once I picked up the ribs, I knew I was in trouble, but we're just gonna keep on trying to do our best. About halfway done with the meats. We're finished with over three pounds, but we still have three pounds to go. I'm gonna work on some of the sausage now. Twenty-seven minutes, forty-three seconds in. It's half in my throat and half out. Just surpassed thirty minutes in. We're making pretty good time, but we still have a lot to go. I'll feel a little bit more confident once the uh, sausage is gone. We're obviously well past the record. <laughs> 33 minutes, 27 seconds in. Great job to Dan and Joel for finishing so fast. We're just trying to do what Nathan did and finish in over 59 minutes and under 60. Last part of the sausage. Thirty-five minutes and fifteen seconds in, we're done with six pounds. We got three more to go. Pulled pork snacks. We're just over 40 minutes in, we got 20 minutes to go. Seven pounds down, we got two more to go. We're doing our best. We're 50 minutes in. We have 10 minutes to go. All right, Nathan Figueroa did this. We'll see how it works for me. I hate doing this, but it's the only way to win. You got it, woo! That's it, that's it! Three and a half minutes to go. Eight and a 
and a half pounds in. Oh, I'm not worried at all. You got it. I tried. We're about to run out of time. Can, will you give it to him if it's in his mouth? Or does it have to be swallowed? Yeah, yeah okay. We're going to do it. I need another minute. Good effort, good effort. Ah, well, I did my best. I'm happy with how that worked out. I knew it was gonna be a bad deal when the, the ribs were about a pound and a half bigger than I was expecting. I was hoping for a seven and a half pounder and that was right around nine pounds, but that's a heck of a lot of food, especially got down to just this left. If I had two more minutes, I could have done it, but I showed up ready, so I'm happy about that. Definitely won before I begun. This is one of the hardest challenges I've ever tried, but uh, delicious challenge. So very big thanks to John and his team here at Smokin' Jay's Real Texas Barbecue in Gulfport, Florida. I might be back to try it. I don't know, we'll have to see. I don't know if we're gonna be back in Florida again after this trip's over. Uh, maybe, I don't know, but yeah. Delicious challenge, so I will have to pay 50 bucks. I will not get any of the prizes, but still belly and effort, I'm happy with that. Can't win them all. I appreciate you guys all being here. <laughs> Sorry for the dunking there at the end, but it was really the only way that I even had a chance. So uh, no win today, but we'll get back on a winning streak and uh, get back going, going for overall win 929 tomorrow. So thank you guys for watching. Good work, good work.